You can drag and drop a folder from your operating system into VS Code to open it as a new workspace. Now let's say I was working over here in the macOS Finder and I want to open the Emmet folder here as a workspace. I can just drag and drop this folder, take it to VS Code here, and I'll drop it inside the main editor area. You can see that VS Code has now opened this as a new workspace. Now if I wanted to open up a different folder instead, so let's go and open up the F# -sharp folder here for example, I'm going to again just drag and drop this, and I'm going to drop it into the main editor area, and VS Code will open that one instead. Now, when I was dragging and dropping, I was kind of targeting the main editor area instead of the Explorer. And that is because if you actually drop into the Explorer, VS Code will, um, instead of opening the new folder as a workspace, it will add it to the current workspace. So let's go in here and say that I want to add the Git folder here to my current workspace. So I want to have both the F -sharp, Sharp folder that I currently have open, along with the Git folder open. And now I'm going to start dragging and dropping from the operating system here. And instead of dropping into the main editor area, I'm actually going to drop over into my Explorer. When I do this, you can see that VS Code is asking me what I would like to do. So one option here is that I could actually copy the contents of that folder into the F# -sharp directory. But in this case, I want to instead add it to my current workspace. So I'll say add folder to workspace. And by doing this, I was able to create a multi-root workspace where we have both the F# -sharp folder and then the Git folder as part of this workspace. So again, when dragging and dropping, if you want to open something as a new workspace, you drop it into the main editor area here. If you want to add a folder to the existing workspace, just drop it into the Explorer, and you can just keep adding folders that way. So that's how you can use drag and drop to either open a new workspace or add a folder to your existing workspace in VS Code.